We live in a world of distraction. Oh, wait. Just gotta answer this text. Shit, that reminds me. I need to email Anne very quickly. What was I saying? <laughs> distracted by my cell phone, by my email, everything that's going on social media, and oftentimes I find I spend my entire day pleasing the requests of others and not doing what I actually need to do. There's this one thing that you can do every single day that will help you get better at something. This thing is focus. Or what my Spanish roommates used to say is fuck us. So why am I so hyped up on this focus thing? Here's the thing. When I was working, I was so distracted with getting better at so many things and trying to do so many things at once. And my manager at the time, I went up to him and I said, what should I do? How do I get better at all these things? What career path should I take? How am I gonna get there? And the only one thing he said was just focus. Sit down, start with something and work on that and focus on that and then move on to the next thing. And it was such simple advice. Like I already knew that, but I wasn't doing it. And then I actually did it and then my career skyrocketed. <laughs> Busking day number four, and there's another musician in the spot I wanted to go to, so I need to have to travel more like 10 minutes that way to find another spot, get out of the sound wave zone. See what I mean? I've been walking around now for another 15 minutes, and you can hear a busker in the bridge already. So I'm gonna walk another 10 minutes that way and see what happens. This one word will actually make you happier. And if you can focus on something and get better, you're gonna be happier instead of living every day fulfilling someone else's requests and not focusing on yourself or something that you can get better at. My challenge to you is just take two hours a day and focus on something, whether it be a relationship, a thing, a skill set, something to get better at, it doesn't matter. Just take two hours and focus on something or focus. Five, 45 minutes later, I found a spot. I'm gonna get set up. I just ran into Roberto. Uh, I used to work with Roberto. I have one of the busiest spots, well, I would say one of the busiest spots in in Berlin right now, the bridge. Everyone has to walk across the bridge and they have to walk in front of me and if they like my music, they'll stop and listen. So, good spot. After 30 minutes of walking, which I found, so, good. Seriously? 30 minutes? Yeah, well, I came here, someone was here, then I walked all the way around. Oh, man. <laughs> Barefoot on the grass Listening to our favorite song When you said you looked a mess I whispered underneath I don't deserve it I've met an angel person tonight Okay, just finished busking about two hours. Now I'm going to an open mic for my friend Dario. And actually, good story. So I was busking 
and an Italian group of kids from Italy, obviously. We're here on a field trip. And I don't know what it is about the song Perfect, but I was singing Perfect by Ed Sheeran again. And they surrounded me. And then I asked one of the one of the um, girls in the group if she wanted to sing. She came up, took the mic, sang, and everyone went wild. Okay, we're here at the open mic. Hi, this is Stefano. We're just waiting to play the show, and then things are gonna get started. Why is the camera? It's not focusing on my face. Ah, oh, there we go. This place is really special. You have to wear these headphones in order to hear the sound coming out of the microphone over there. So, like, Stefano and I are gonna put our headphones on, and then someone's gonna play up there, but the whole bar will be completely quiet. Pretty cool concept.